everyone welcome back to the channel i hope you all are doing well so in this lecture we are going to discuss about what are the top three technologies that are required for every data engineer out there so it will be very fun so without further any ado let's get into it so the first technology is data storage and the databases which is like a foundation of data engineering field so here we are talking about relational databases like PostgreSQL, MySQL, which is like designed to handle structured data. Structured data means the data is present in the tabular format in which the data is represented as a row and columns. But you don't have to stop there. You also have to explore NoSQL databases like the Cassandra as well as the MongoDB. So Cassandra is a very popular NoSQL databases right now where the data is stored in a column based format as well as the MongoDB stores the data as the JSON document. So these are very helpful to store semi-structured data at a very massive scale because today every industry is generating terabytes of data every day and the storage solutions are endless. So in this fierce competition, NoSQL databases is a very good skill to have for every data professional. So the next technology in our list is like a data processing, which is the next step after data storage. So once you figure out how to store your big data into the storage solutions, now you have to process that data to convert it into some meaningful insights. Because at the end of the day, that should be your main goal to convert raw data into some meaningful insights. So in the data processing world, Hadoop is pretty powerful tool for processing your raw data. So we have like the HDFS, which is a backbone for our Hadoop, which is distributed file system and it is backed by the Google file system. So Hadoop is very efficient for processing large chunks of batch data. And if you are talking about the real time data, there comes the Apache Spark in the picture. So Apache Spark is also one of the most popular tool for processing big data in which it has the capability to process batch data as well as the near real time data analysis. And the last but not least, cloud technologies. This is one of the most important and the crucial technology in the world of big data. And there are big players in the cloud market, which are Azure, AWS, as well as the GCP. So they provide like a higher scalability for your data solutions, including like the powerful computing and they provide several services to do data analytics in cloud. So learning any of the cloud technology, you will open vast amount of opportunities in the world of big data. So there you have it. You got the three major technologies in the world of data engineering, which is like the databases and the data storage solution. Then you got the data processing framework and the cloud technologies. But let me tell you one important thing. Data engineering is a very dynamic field. So there will be a lot of changes going forward, but learning these three major pillars will really help you to build foundational knowledge of the data engineering. So if you like this video, please hit subscribe and also follow our social media to get latest updates. Thanks for watching.